very unwise step to take at this point of time. It has implications for the state of Jammu and Kashmir, and I am talking of the entire Riyasat of Jammu and Kashmir. It has implications for the rest of India, and it has international implications. Now, it appears to me that we have neither taken history into account, nor have we taken the current situation into account. And uh, we have uh, rushed into doing something which has not been attempted for the last so many decades. As far as the pro process is concerned, the process, as I said, is highly dubious. I do not think it will stand uh, judicial scrutiny. And somebody, I'm sure, we're going to move uh, the Supreme Court of India. The will of the people of the rest of the country cannot supersede the will of the people of Jammu and Kashmir. It was absolutely necessary that the opinion, the approval of the Assembly of Jammu and Kashmir should have been taken before this was brought to Parliament. By not doing it, we are riding roughshod on the uh, feelings and the opinion of the people in Jammu and Kashmir. The governor of Jammu and Kashmir does not represent the people of India. I mean, people of Jammu and Kashmir, he represents the government of India in Jammu and Kashmir. So how can his, uh, uh, you know, uh, cooperation in this matter be taken as uh, the will of the people of uh, Jammu and Kashmir? Thank you.